Wonderful! <laughs> this is traveling. The old Scar Inn. Is it in the place? I bet it's in that place. I'm going to be very upset when I find out that it is in that place. Ah, Srendar. Srendar, have mercy on your poor little kitty brethren. Hmm. So have a look in the rat in the pot. Ah. Oh. I hear some action in here. Drota Drotasar, commoner, are you new here? I don't believe we've met. I don't believe we have. It's nice to meet you, friend. Hmm. And how about you? What is the scar? The shell of the emperor crab. The homes and shops of the manor district are under scar. The shell of the emperor crab. Shell of the Emperor Crab. Juju! Juju! What do you think of Argonians? Hmm, their physiology and customs are not understood by scholars. Yes, I have a fascination with the scale skins. I will admit. Oh, hello! Tongue Toad. I like this name. Let us barter. What do you have? Guide to Alderun? Hmm. Interesting. And another. T-Lan. That's not uh, the funnest name that I've heard. The Black Arrow. Hmm. I take this. I have for later. Honor Among Thieves. I think I have read this. Well. Hello, Orc. How are you? Are you part of the Thieves' Guild? Any jobs or lead for me, Toad? I was hoping you could give me one. That's okay. Everything's okay here. So I have to assume Ald Scar is definitely under this Emperor shell or some such. Oh my. That is a manor there, is it not? Or the temple. We have passed all these places before. You are enchanter? Oh no, Altscar Inn! Ah! Oh, fortunate. Okay. Now we're on the track. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Hasur. Could I ask you about Hasur Zain Subani? The trader? He'll be downstairs trading, or in the back room below the bar. Well, at least we are in the correct place. Let's uh, go have a talk to him. Perhaps we can just ask him what he likes. Hmm. Hello? Sashiv? Any goodies for me? No, nothing. That's quite all right. Oh. The five far stars. Rise from your darkness, red mountain. Spread your dark clouds and green vapors. Birth earthquakes, shatter stones. Feed the winds with fire. Flay the tents of the tribes from the land. Feed the burned earth with our souls. Our souls. <laughs> Yet never shall you have your rule over me. Never shall I tremble or flinch from your power. Never shall I yield my home and hearth. And from my tears shall spring forth the flowers of Grassland Springs. Okay. Red Book of Riddles. Doth contain all diverse manner of riddles and follies. Oh, this is definitely something that I should take. It has a tail, a side, and a head. I call it what I call a snake, but it has no body, and it is dead. It must be a drake. That's, that's money. Tail, sides, head. Interesting. Behind the bar? Perhaps he was up there, and I just passed right by him. Hello, hello, hello. 
I'm looking for Hussein, Zubani, some such. Juju, can you tell me about Hasur? He'll be downstairs trading, or in the back room below the bar. Please, well, well, what do you think? Well, I need this. I need that. <laughs> you give me all these things. He'll be downstairs trading. Downstairs, downstairs, downstairs trading. Downstairs trading. Hey, buddy, do you know where Hasur is? Or in the back room below the bar. Hmm. Is there something you need? Yes, where's this guy? Nobody wants to tell me anything. Oh. 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 Drums. Do you play drums? Well, I'll ask you later. For now, I just need some of this. I'm a little light in the pockets, you see. Thank you for the donation. Downstairs, trading. Below the bar. Hmm. Maybe we should wait for him. If we wait a while, he's bound to pop up. Ah, oh, the moon gives and the moon takes away, you know? Sometimes I have it very easy, but I have not been having much luck lately with finding my targets. Or not targets, that's a terrible way to say it. But it is just part of the duality of the moon. There are gods for the duality of the moon. I don't talk about being religious that much, but being a bard, I have studied it. Just a wee bit. Joan and Jod are the two gods of the moon. They represent duality, fate, as well as luck, which is a big one for me. I rely rather heavily on luck. I do wish I could find these people. Oh, is this the downstairs? Of course. Of course. Tundir! Good day! The trader? That's him over there. Where? This one? How are you Hasur? Uh, no, that's him over there. Uh, uh, you? Are you Hasur? Hello, friends. I am Hasur Zerbani, Brandar. May you be blessed. May you bless and be blessed. I do not wish to be rude, but if you have business, speak it. For I am at leisure and would not pref and would prefer to be left alone with my thoughts. Well, um, yes, a little bit of business indeed. I see you wish to learn of the Ashlanders for me. And what is it that you wish to learn? What are their gift-giving customs? A curious question. A sign is a gift of courtesy among strangers. A gift is a sign of courtesy among strangers, and affection among friends. Among strangers, a thoughtful gift is a sign that you are cautious, considerate, and aware of the other's wants and needs. Such is particularly useful for traders and travelers. Among friends, it is a private thing and subtle, with great risk for the test of the gift is how well it is tailored to the receiver. And what would be a thoughtful gift for you? Yes, a gift that shows you have taken the care to learn something of the receiver. For example, I love pottery. No stranger could be expected to know this, but a book of pottery given to me by a stranger shows the giver respects me, and has made a special effort to know and please me. But now I have answered your question, and would like some time to myself. If you'll excuse me? Of course, my friend. Goodbye. A book of pottery. Interesting. I should do some thinking on where to find one. I bet there is a bookshop here somewhere. We should go and find it. Hmm. I did see a bookseller up this way, I believe. Perhaps, perhaps. Oh. Hello. Trauma, trauma, trauma. Trauma route for me? Hmm. Was this the bookshop? No. General merchandise. Clothier. Hmm. I am sure there was one somewhere. Relatively close. No. How about this one? G 
Gindrala Helleran's house. Not what I'm looking for. Rat in the pot. Rat in the pot. That's a terrible name for an establishment. Guild of Fighters. Perhaps we should bed down. I can talk to some of the fighters here about where to find a book of pottery, although it's probably not the best place to ask, to be completely honest. Of course. Hello, Barodras. That's a cool hat you've got there. Oh, Colovian Fur Helm. Cheap Restore Health. Standard Restore Fatigue. Yes, I need these. Thank you so much. Little help for me. Mm-hmm. Hello, friend. Let's talk about advancement. The Fighters Guild recognizes you, Brandar. You are now Brandar the Journeyman. Wonderful. You have more orders. I don't have much work for anyone under the rank of swordsman. These Redorans are honorable enough. They keep things pretty quiet around here. If you ever need any advice or any questions about the orders you get, come talk to me. I used to be the guild master. There are a few things I might tell a promising journeyman. Seek Ida's Fire Eye and Balmora to get your feet wet, or Harundi and Seathrus more if you're up for more challenges. You may also speak with Lord, Lord Bumal Groa Glash in Vivek for your orders. Hmm, I was just in Vivek. Perhaps, oh look at this table. What a weird shaped table that is. <laughs> Perhaps I should head back to Vivek? There's just so much to do. ABCs for Barbarians, yes. I remember this book. Give me gold. Give me gold. I need this. I will put it to good use. Oh, hello. Did you see that? You didn't, did you? Wow. Many implements. But nothing magical. Perhaps you can just repair my uh, viper sword. Thank you so much. Wonderful. Well, friends, I think we shall uh, have a little rest in the Fighters Guild. We shall have a look uh, around Aldrun a little bit more for that book of pottery. I do hope you shall join me for it, friends. Until the next time. Bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye. See you again. Goodbye, goodbye. See. You. My friend